Hey yo, what's up boys? It's your boy Jose Zaniga and for today we're going to be talking about the six colors every guy should be adding to the wardrobe this season. Yes, you know, I love my blacks, my whites, my neutrals as much as the next guy. And I swear by them. But the stylish connoisseurs you studs are, you know that summer not only means lighter fabrics, but also brighter colors. Number one, the washed out pink. This is part of that sand slash neutral color palette that's very prevalent right now with streetwear. And since it's not a hot pink or a bubblegum pink, you're not running any risk, nor does it take too much courage to pull off. Personally, I, I like wearing this shade of pink in my sneakers and my hoodies and even in my dress shirts and for the summer it looks perfect number two olive green it's really crazy how a simple color change on a garment can make you look so much better and even make your old favorite become your new go-to let me explain See, I love denim jackets. I have about three or four of them in different shades. But as of recently, I kind of stopped wearing them because I got kind of bored with them. So I left them in the back of my closet. The other day, I was in H&M and I saw this olive green trucker jacket for only 30 bucks. I bought it and let's just say it's been the best purchase of 2018 because I'm wearing it all the time now. Olive just works with everything and it's just enough of a pop that I stand out, but I don't look like a kid. Honestly, I love Olive and you should pick it up too. Number three, electric blue. This is definitely one of those colors that takes some getting used to, but this is a great shade to change it up from your boring navy that you wear every single week. Better yet, it's a color that you can add to your navy monochromatic looks to really make it pop and stand out. And the color, even though it's hard to wear, you can wear it in dress shirts, you can wear it in t-shirts. I've seen it in shorts and chinos nose and even with suits but if all that is still too much for you you can still wear it as something as simple as a bracelet like this one from rose gold and black see this is exactly why i love accessories and i tell you guys to wear them so much because say you like these colors and you want to add them to your wardrobe but maybe some of them are too much or you don't know how to add colors you don't want to come across as too bold and show off -y. well an easy way to do it and one way i like to is implement colors with my jewelry for example rose gold and black has these beautiful blue bracelets that work great when you're wearing subtle clothes that you want that extra pop without being too much and that's the importance of accessories that's why accessories help you stand apart and stand out from the crowd because most guys they aren't wearing this stuff and when you buy it from a store like from rose gold and black their jewelry is so affordable that it makes it worthwhile you're gonna be wearing this for years to come and it only costs you a few bucks actually probably less than that because you're watching this video and you're part of the family you already know there's a link down below to rose gold and black that you can go and check out the store but that that right there my friends that's that's a special link that's a magical link that has a significant discount on everything on the site so when you click that link you're gonna actually see all my top favorites favorites that I have in my personal collection that I use every week all the time to stand out and look more stylish but that's not what you care about what you care about is that they're super affordable they're heavily discounted when you go through it scroll see something you like if you like anything just add it to the cart and automatically you already saved money. You don't even have to add a discount and you can buy this stylish piece of accessory that's going to help you look more stylish at a massive discount. The cool thing and why I like them so much is because their jewelry is masculine. So it's nothing that's too feminine or too bold or too flashy. It's just perfect and it works with almost any guy in any type of style. So if you guys want to check out our sponsor, Rose Gold and Black, add some pop to your style, some color, look a little bit more stylish. There's going to be a link down below so you guys can check it out. The fourth color you should definitely add to your wardrobe wardrobe brick okay hmm I, I don't know if I should tell you yet uh, what the heck okay so this was supposed to be a surprise but this new brick shade is one of the new colors that's gonna be offered in our new essentials tees now it's gonna be a limited run with only a few in stock because it's one of those off colors that it's really bold and not every stylish man can pull off. So like I said, there's only a few in stock. So I doubt this color is going to last long and it's a limited run. So I don't think we're going to be producing them again. So if you want this certain shade, remember to be there July 7th at 10 a.m. Because this one's going to probably go fast. But there's a reason why we produce this shade. I truly believe every guy should have this shade in their wardrobe. This color has been popping up in runways because just like another color, which I'll talk about later in the video, it's making a very strong comeback, especially with that whole 90s aesthetic. It's another one of those colors that are very bold, but also masculine, and it's perfect for summer 
and fall. The fifth color that every guy should add to their wardrobe is the color red. If you've watched any of my videos on being more attractive or dressing attractive, you know why you should own red. It just attracts women because it subconsciously sends a message of power, of strength, of danger, of sexuality. Do, do you want me to keep going or is that enough to convince you that you need this color in your wardrobe? For me, the easiest way to wear such a bold color is either through a flannel or a jacket. And finally, the sixth and final color you should add to your wardrobe is mustard yellow. Okay, so from this list, this is probably the strongest one on the eyes. And while it's a little bit more difficult to pull off, it is making a strong comeback. Just like I told you that the brick color is, this is the other color I was talking about that's making a strong comeback, especially from the 90s. In the 90s, this color was being worn a lot, and now you're seeing it on the runway. And that's basically it for me in today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also, don't forget to check out our sponsor, Rose Gold and Black. They're going to be linked down below as well. That's it for me today. See you next time.